Hi, how are you? I actually thought that maybe after this we can kind of explain a little bit more about where we are now and, and stuff like that. But um, so my name is Karen Bliznik, um, and I'm trying to think actually. I feel like I've been to this competition so many times when I was younger. Um, but as far as I can remember, maybe Terry can even correct me if he, if he needs to. Um, but I, I uh, don't have quite as cool of a story, but I, I was here uh, quite a few years, and I think I finally made it um, second place my senior year in college. And um, actually also with the Boston University Trumpet Ensemble, did we make it in second place that year too? Um, and then went on to my master's degree at Northwestern, and um, I ended up getting first in the master's division and actually the trumpet ensemble that year ended up winning too so that was quite a killer year and that was my last year here i was like i'm never gonna go back there again I've, i don't have to show my face there anymore um but yeah no i mean i i remember having such a great time here and actually even just warming up and seeing people go by and just people kind of like looking in your room and, and there's it's really high energy but it's in such a good way because you you get to meet people that are just like you, you know, that spend hours and hours in the practice room and just are just so excited to release this music that are, that's inside of them. So anyway, that's, I'm, I'm very excited that I'm here and, and can't wait to actually play this afternoon. So um, that's my NTC story. Um, okay, so uh, I'd say about a year and a half after I won NTC, uh, I went to the Spoleto Music Festival, which is actually another thing I thought might be a really great thing to talk about music festivals. I've been to a lot of them and have met some really great people that way, and some that are still my best friends still today. You learn so much from your peers um, at, in places like that because you're forever pushing each other to be better. But um, uh, I went to the Spoleto Music Festival and I happened to win um, the job for the principal in Charleston Symphony while I was there, which was really cool. Um, and then about a year and a half, uh, about a year after that, um, I joined the, um, the Charlotte Symphony for about a year and a half. And while I was in um, Charlotte, uh, they don't actually have a summer season there. Um, I auditioned for the Santa Fe Opera. Um, and the Santa Fe Opera had an opening, which happens very rarely because it's quite an amazing orchestra. Um, it's such a beautiful place to be in the summer and the repertoire and the singers, oh, they're just amazing. Um, but so luckily I, uh, I won that um, principal in that right now and um, also about a year and a half after uh, I started with Charlotte, I won uh, the associate principal job in the Atlanta Symphony. Um, also a utility position, so that kind of means we really just do everything. Whenever someone needs us, we just do it. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that's kind of where I am right now. Um, nearing the end of this season and uh, out to Santa Fe. So that's what I'm doing right now. If you have any questions, feel free to keep them in your head. We're happy to answer anything.